welcome to Ardrossan on the west coast of Scotland. Only 45 minutes from Glasgow with some fantastic public transport links. Bus services, three railway stations and a ferry terminal which is why Ardrossan is known as the gateway to Arran. Every year one million tourists catch the ferry from Ardrossan to the Isle of Arran. But what if just one percent of those tourists actually stopped in Adrossen. That's 10,000 people. But what's Adrossen got to offer? We've got a historic castle, which William Wallace stormed in 1296. A 280 berth marina, kids play park, indoor and outdoor bowling. Ow! And beautiful sandy beaches joining Adrossen to the towns of Saltcoats and Stevenson which are collectively known as the Three Towns. Right across the road from the beach is the Barney St John. This church building was built in 1844 and the adjacent hall building built in 1887. But they both fell into disrepair and the Church of Scotland sold to us in 2014. We want to give those 10,000 tourists something to stay in Adrossen for by turning these derelict buildings into an events and visitor centre. So this is where you, your imagination and hopefully your funding come into play. Picture this area here as a vibrant, fun, glass covered cafe connecting both buildings and catering for hundreds of hungry beach lovers. So imagine having your wedding in here. As you come in the main door, beautiful red carpets on the floor, and as you come round to the side here, our candlelit staircases taking you up to the gallery. And as you come into the main church area, you can look up to this huge concave ceiling, which we hope to paint. No! Not that kind of painting! This kind of painting! And just look at my massive organ! And we're going to make it more impressive by having it backlit, like this. The church was built to seat 1,200 people. But once the pews are taken out, it can be used for a variety of events like this. Or this. And a bar area installed. And a VIP area in this upper balcony. The finished event centre can be used for live bands, plays, musicals, conferences, art exhibitions, sporting events such as boxing, Mai Tai, MMA, but only limited by your imagination. There are weddings, and then there's Barney St John weddings. The additional attraction for tourists will be the instalment of a small visitor centre in the cafe area. A visitor centre dedicated to one of Scotland's greatest leaders. 
No! William Wallace! Ah! There was a statue from Wallace's monument in Stirling which commemorates the Braveheart movie. We'll have a replica of his sword for you to be photographed with and we'll work with the Society of William Wallace to display some unique artefacts which tourists will love to see. So now for the serious bit. We are looking for three types of investor. The professional, the crowdfunder, and companies and individuals from the performing arts and heritage who want to be involved in this project. You know, if half the people in Scotland donated just one pound, this project would be funded tomorrow. Or you could donate the price of a cup of coffee, or a fiver, or a tenner. But we know that some of you may want to dig a little bit deeper into your pockets. There'll be discounts to events, access to our VIP area, and for larger donations, we'll put your name on a gold plaque on our wall. Now, this building is over 170 years old. Think of that. Your name, or your company name, on our wall for the next 170 years. You're not going to get a better advertisement deal than that. So what are you waiting for? Share this video around the world and donate as much as you can to this worthwhile cause. Think of it as saving a historical building, creating an events and visitor centre, or think of it as investing in a wee piece of Scotland. Slange. Obviously the Barney St John isn't currently used for weddings, but it remains a popular backdrop for marriage photographs. So, thanks for letting me share my vision of the Barney St John with you. I'm sure you'll agree it's got huge potential. But, it can only happen with your help and your funding. Every penny counts. Thanks for watching.